years. Yeah. And what gave him credibility? What gave him credibility? His lifestyle, right? Yeah, that's right. It was never his. It was never his lifestyle that got you to sign up with them. That was what gave it credibility. What got you to sign up with them was the trust that he built with you. So then, if we can build that trust with our audience. And, and make sure they understand we're doing it for them. Like, hey, look, check this out, man. I just wanted to show you this. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ocean. I hope you're having an amazing day, a great day. Have a good one. And then that's that. And then the next video, it's nothing but content and value for them to get rich. And then the next video is more content for them to make even more money. And then the next video is going to be Idris. Hey, I just bought this Lamborghini. It's yellow. It's amazing. It's nice. All right, you guys have a good one. And then the next video is more content on how to get rich. Next video, more content, how to get rich. The next video is going to be you, Danny. Hey, I'm here in the office. This is a tower. I want to show you guys the view. It's amazing. Have a good one. And then the next video, you see how it's massive value for the audience, not for us. That's right. You see what Makes I mean? Sense. Even when Makes that moment, sense. You get it. You get what I'm saying. It's not, yeah, yeah. hey, look at me. I have a Lamborghini. Fuck you. It's like nobody cares about that person anymore. It was good four years ago, five years ago, because you were the only one doing it. Five yeah. years ago, if you say, hey, look at me, I have a Lambo, and I can teach you how to get it, I want to know. But now I know what you're going to say. I have a Lambo, I teach you how to get it. I'm going to say how, and they're going to pitch me your online opportunity. Everyone knows that shit. That's true. <laughs> you have to pay one fast, and you have to register here. Huh? <laughs> Everyone knows this. You know it. Dude, that's what I'm saying. It's so saturated that it doesn't that shock you that you knew the script and we never even discussed on that being the script and you knew what to say. Oh, let me tell you how you got this Lamborghini. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. It's crazy. It's already in your brain. It's said so many times. So we don't want to be those people. We want to be the people that people swear to God and they can put their right hand on the Bible no, no fingers crossed and say the three marketeers are gonna are making me rich. I dude, we want this to be so value that before they do their next move with their online business, they come and check in on the on, on our page. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Let's go see what the three marketeers are doing. Exactly. What would they say if I tell them? That is how social them. media influencers were created, also. You know, they don't really tell you. What, what do they have? They just show you things and, and they, they record like, the, yeah, from inside their cars, their whatever. Because it just doesn't work like that, brother. I've been studying this shit. It, it used, that's why I, I did have success a little bit three years ago with Black Ops. But now that I came back, I'm like, all this shit that I did doesn't work. It's a whole new business. And I'm talking to my uncle and I opened it, my uncle's business three years ago, two years ago with Forex. And he had massive success. He made all his money and everything. And now he swears is the COVID-19 why no one's investing with him or making money. And I'm like, when was the last time you innovated your company and you did different marketing, different sales? And he hasn't since I did it for him. And I was telling him, like, look, dude, this in this world, the people that stay, ahead, the people that get ahead, are the people that stay ahead. That's it. If you wake up tomorrow and you don't get ahead, you ain't gonna stay ahead. You'll be behind. That's just what it is. And that's what I told him. I was like, look, for two years you haven't did anything new. You haven't provided any value, even though you, everything his company is legit, bro. You're gonna make money. You're gonna get your money back. You're gonna get the. But people are tired of the same ads. They're tired of the same person talking. They're tired of the same techniques that he's doing. And I told him this already. And I'm like, look, times change. And it's the same for us. You know how many people still think that by showing nice cars and shit, people are going to sign up with them? Yeah. You know yeah. how many people still think that by doing a post, hey, who wants to make this much money, people are going to sign up? That shit doesn't work like that no more. If you're not doing the webinars and you're not doing the events, you're not even in the run. Like Facebook posts and shit like that, it's just not working. It's just ain't gonna work, bro. Who do you, no one made it to the, I don't gotta get into that. You guys know about all that. Um, well, I guess I should because we were recording, but like imagine, no, he can pull it off now. I was gonna say uh, Russell Brunson putting a Facebook post, hey, who wants to learn how to make a thousand dollars? A motherfucker, a bunch of people would join, but that's not, 
but that's not what 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 I mean. I mean anyone else that hasn't built a billion dollar business, it just doesn't work like that anymore. It's all about people know. I don't know. What do you think, Idris? Do people now know? I think that I think people have spent so much time online that now they know what's bullshit and what's not. And okay. even five, ten years ago, you can get bullshit through the online because people didn't could not communicate like this. Even video Depends. chats, huh? Depends. Because, for example, uh, imagine my profile. Uh, my profile is kind of empty, honestly. My Instagram profile, I upload not much often. I upload like when uh, there is a special occasions. And I never show my car. I never, sh I never show shit. Imagine now tomorrow I show up with a Lamborghini. What will people say? Of course, this shit is not his car. I don't remember yeah. this guy driving this Lamborghini. They didn't see the process of, exactly. of becoming that person, you know? And if you show up you just suddenly with, with things like that, you know? No, that's not. But what are you talking? That wasn't even my question, Idris. What, what are you talking about, Idris? I mean, it's 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 related to your question. Now people knows when things uh, are fake ah, or real. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that would only happen if they were like already following you or something. But yes. yeah, people know if you're just. What I'm saying is, people know if you're just out for the money, or you're scamming or whatever. Yeah. Or if you're really trying to help them. Five years ago, people could not tell the difference. Yeah, that's okay. true. But now, listen, if tomorrow... You know what I'm I, saying? No, no fucking yeah. way. You see a Lamborghini online five years ago, and they tell you, they're gonna, hey, I'm going to become your best friend and show you how to do this. You're fucking clicking on the link five years ago. You're like, damn right. He's the only guy probably in your whole world. Well, maybe not you guys. You live in the Middle East. But if you're like in America or somewhere over here, and somebody shows you a Lamborghini and tells you, I can show you how to get one of those in the next 60 days. You're going to click the fucking link of five course. years ago. <laughs> well, I think that still Easy works. Easy money. Huh? I think you can still doing that, but it's not that effective. That it's effective, not you know? effective. It's not That's safe. That's my point. Because yeah. now people can see the bullshit on camera. It wasn't like that before, yes. you guys. And you know what's before happening? Before you... Yeah, it wasn't like that at all before. Before, you didn't even have HD video. So people would have to take on your opportunity based on a picture that was taken like a thousand different times to, for the Lamborghini to look good. And then the copy is going to say whatever. Your brain is going to interpret that however your subconscious mind wants to interpret that. You can't get away with that shit anymore. This time, they really feel your energy at the webinar. They feel your how genuine you are on your Facebook lives. They understand, they can read who you are just based on your activity. Just on the, when did you join? Who's your friends? Who is this? People were not up on game like that before. Like at all. Now, if you're, if you're not being genuine about loving people and taking them to the next level, they can smell that shit, dude. They can see it. They can smell it. You just look different. You just don't look. And then the people that actually care, about you, like the the Gary V's and the fucking uh, the Russell, what's his name? Russell what? That's Russell, Russell Brunson. Brunson. So now people put a Russell Brunson next to your picture because their subconscious, the brain is smart, you guys. So now guess what? They're comparing that guy next to you. Do you talk like him? Are yeah. you that genuine? Are you that sincere? Are you that honest? Do you provide that much value? No, oh, he's a scammer. He's a scammer, yeah. He's a scammer. There's so many people yeah. out there now. I'm, I'm, I'm going to put you next to Tony Robbins because Tony Robbins has a YouTube channel, Instagram, and Facebook. I'm going to put you next to uh, Grant Cardone. Yeah, it, he has a YouTube, a Facebook. And see, this is what I mean. Everyone has the same thing now. It's a plain, yeah. it's a plain field. So now, now you are being judged next to the real guys doing it. That's what I'm saying. Five years ago, dude, you'd be a fucking bum. Just take a picture next to a Lamborghini and people would think you were like a Grant Cardone. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know something you're saying, right? I remember like some months ago we were in the office and I upload, I uploaded the video on some groups like, yo, yo guys, what's up? Look at the view. Uh, only for today. We are receiving this, this, and we are giving you a free book. I was trying to get their emails, you know? So you, the, all the fucking comments were like, 
fake, lol, fake video. Yo, scam, scam, don't register. Scam, 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 scam. This video is not true. That's how it is now. But this is what Darren Little was teaching. But how can people act like that if you're not pushing anything on them? People can't act like that if you're not pushing anything on them. If you're like, yeah. hey, look, I just bought this Lamborghini. It's fucking amazing. I love it. I wanted to show it to you guys. It's, it's great. You're not pushing anything. Hey, I love it, you guys. It's amazing. It's great. I'm having a webinar. Oh, it's a scam. It's a scam. It's a scam. Think about that, you guys. I just showed you my Lamborghini. It's not even a scam. It's real. I am having a webinar. But just mm -hmm. because I connected my Lamborghini to there's a webinar, now they're like, no, no, no. It's got to be a scam. That's right. So look, that's it. <clears throat> so our goal is to not give a fuck about others. We only take care of us three. And we discuss all of this online and we work on it online. And anyone that loves us, we love them back. Whoever yeah. hits on us, fuck. It's like, if you ain't with me, you're against me. Because that's that, that, again, that goes back to being an alpha male. You can't be the nice guy in this world. Those people are beta. They want to be fucking nice. Because they don't want to hurt people. That, why do people want to be nice to begin with? Because they don't want to hurt people's feelings. Alpha males don't care about feelings. <laughs> they yeah. don't. They're like, what the fuck? How are you feeling bad is going to stop me from taking care of my children and being the best husband for my wife? It ain't. So it's not my responsibility to find out how the fuck you feel. That's not what alphas do. Alphas take care of the woman, the kids, the house, their universe, their planets, not other people's feelings. Ain't nobody got time for that shit. Think about that. Imagine if you had to waste your alpha energy instead of your wife or four or five wives, I don't know how many you have, on a fucking guy, uh, on another guy that's upset about something. I don't have time to give you that kind of, I don't give a fuck how sad you are. I'm an alpha male. Coco, you want to gossip about your feelings? You go talk to a woman. Men only talk about work and money. That's it. With that protecting, protection, work. That's what it is. That's what it is. It, like if I was a woman, and I had a husband, and he was giving his energy, his alpha male energy to a fucking guy that's crying about his bills. I would, I would feel very betrayed. I would be like, you're not a real man. You, how are you giving away your energy to all kinds of other people when you got your wife and kids at home? You need to be, it's just what it is, you guys. You can't be trying to fix the world. Those are betas, man. People that try to fix the world. Yeah. Oh, well. Bro. I have to learn more about this alpha male shit. Uh, anyway. You have the master here. You can learn everything. The master. Yeah. <laughs> See, I got to stop doing that. I keep putting myself down. I talked to my mom about that this morning. Because I was talking with my ex-girl. And my ex-girlfriend, she's, she's... Long story short, we can't talk anymore because she says she loves me. This is another ex-ex-girl. This is one what of the, the three. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, because I was one of the three. three. I had three Listen, before I came You should come to Dubai. You can marry four. <laughs> I know. No, I didn't marry. I would have married him. I'm glad I didn't. I'm glad I didn't marry him though, because that's not. I wasn't an alpha male fully yet. Now I am. Now I understand it. And look, isn't it, it, it? Aren't Muslims? If you if you have four wives, don't you have to treat all four the same? Don't you have what? You have to treat all four the same. You have to be able to afford all four of them. If yes, you buy one yes. Mercedes, you got to buy. I wasn't yeah, doing right. it like that. So I had like my favorite. I had my slot. I had this like one does uh -huh. something, one doesn't. That's not an alpha male. That's a bully. That's a guy that's, uh, he's unjust. That's not a real man. I, I know one man guy who was really wealthy. What he did is he had like three wives. So he put up like each of them typical uh, villas, like three villas next to each other, <laughs> you know? And each woman, whatever this one gets, she, she gets also the other one gets. So it's like that. So everything is divided equally to all of them. Because that's how it is. Well, take that same thing that I'm telling you because of the energy. He divides Man, my the grandfather energy. had four. <laughs> well, Your he grandfather had energy. four? Yeah. Man, so look, you divide my, his energy equally. Mm, Go ahead. My mother, my mother, she has sibling, like, 
uh, three, three, four siblings, like from different <laughs> mothers. <laughs> no. And by Did the way, yeah, in, the, in the old time, they live all in the same house. Nobody give a fuck. It should be like that. You should no, be no, like that. It is like that now. Just like no, that, 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 my, my, my father said, son, it doesn't matter what happens. You please don't have more than one because I'm going to explain you what will happen if you have more than one. Even though <laughs> you don't feel it, they will be jealous. And both of them, they will be like not happy deep inside, even though they will pretend they are happy only to make you happy. So but at the end, they will be... Beta. That's right. I, well, my, well, my father <laughs> is the biggest piece of the family. No, I was going to tell you. I was, I was going to say, like, dude, who the fuck said women don't want to feel like that? Who said that women best, 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 best way of living is by feeling jealous? Do you know that the number one thing about an alpha male, and it's like the lion in the jungle, he makes other women fight for him, and women love to fight for that man, and if they don't have someone to fight for that man, they're not really fully happy because now they don't believe that it's somebody else wants their man. What the fuck? Yeah. Dude, if a woman, no, what fucking woman wants a guy that's not fought for? It? Why would he want the guy that nobody wants? Nobody yeah, that's how my human mind works. Like, you, you want what everyone wants. Mm hmm. That's why everyone wants the Lamborghini and you want the Lamborghini also. And you don't mm -hmm. want that Toyota Camry. <laughs> for example, but, I mean, who the fuck will fight wives. for the Camry? Imagine having four wives. Exactly. So you have to be a Lamborghini all, and a Toyota Camry. All of them. All of them look at you like a Lamborghini, and they look at every other man in the world like a Toyota, because no other man has four women. Yeah, that's right. Man, I mean, to have a four woman, you you have to be alpha male like big time. Man. Big fucking yeah, time, yeah, bro. Because yeah. you, like, you, because you gotta go through even making like. Let's say your woman cries, you gotta be strong enough to let her cry, because man. you know that that's what betas need. Betas need to be able to cry, and betas need to let their emotions out, and betas need to explain themselves. See, a real alpha male knows that and he's gonna let her cry. A beta male, baby, what's wrong? And shit like that. Baby, yeah. what's wrong? Is there anything that I did? How can I help? Shit like that. That right there turns a woman off. Because how many times have you heard where they say women don't even, they don't want you to give them solutions. They just want you to hear them. No one ever finished that sentence. And I just came to me right now from God. So look, you know how they're always, when a woman's com complaining and you start giving them solutions, I'm sure you heard of this, Danny. Hey, Drew, have you ever heard of that? They're like, women don't want solutions. They just want you to listen to them. Yeah, not really. That's yeah, 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 of course. You know why that is? Because women have to vent because it's part of their beta energy. Betas have to cry. Betas have to complain. But victim. if you give them a solution... Victim, victim mentality, that's it. And it's, it, and, it's, and, it's, and it's fair because the woman is the victim. It's up to her, if she, it's up to her husband if she eats or not. For, she, for her, her. Th that's, that's a weapon. That's how she gets what she wants, you know? Right. Yeah. So it makes sense for the woman like to the baby. Cry. Right. And guess who has to show up and fix everything? The man, the alpha male. Yeah. So, because you, got, you have to be like a father figure, even though she's your wife. It Bro, when you weird, have a small kid, when you have a small kid, how he gets what he wants? He cry, right? right? He cries. Exactly. Yes, the exactly. Same, the same thing. Right, so if you go to a woman and you're like, oh, why are you crying? Let me help you. Let me do this. You did two things wrong. One, you're a pussy because she made you. Now she knows. Let me put it to you. Like, now she knows that her female emotions rubbed off on you. Imagine that. She's like, me being sad made him sad. And they're going to tell you bullshit. You know what they're going to tell you, Idris? They're going to like, oh, my God, you really love me. You couldn't stand to see me sad, so you got sad with me. What they're really saying. It's like you're yeah. a bitch. It's like, <laughs> yeah. it's okay. Like, I know I can get what I want. Instead of you being strong, you want to break with me, huh? And now I can get what I want. Now I can and get now that I gift. Can get what I want. You know what's <laughs> sexier for a woman than getting what she wants? What? Taking it away from her. What's sexier? There's like almost nothing sexier for a woman than for one for her to be jealous of her man 
And two, for her to always be striving for something. Do you want to know why women always want to go out and party and have fun? Women uh, always need something to do. This is why women can deal with fucking all kinds of shit. They can be on the phone. They can cook, take care of the kids and the husband at the same time. Men can't do that. Women have to constantly be occupied like that. Constantly. So if you don't, so if you give them their way, they're no longer occupied. If you help them stop crying, they're no longer venting. If everything that we've been taught, it's fucking dumb. Like you guys need to study the alpha world, like the alpha energy. And you realize that there is a 0.1% of real men inside the 1% of real men. So there's like 99% is the world, 1% are men. And then there's a 1% inside of that 1% that's alpha males. So there's like another level to being a, a, a male, a, a man. Because there's a, there's a bunch of men, but they're not alpha males. You know how you know this? If you have a room of 20 guys and Grant Cardone walks in, who are they going to look at? One of the 20 or Grant? Grant Cardone, of course. Yeah. And there's no women there. So there's all men. There's 21 men in there, but how come everyone looked at that one? Because that's the alpha male. There's 21 men and only one alpha male. Exactly. I mean, that's one, that, that is one what, what we talked about uh, leadership. You walked in in a room, all right? And you will see everyone gathered around one person always mm -hmm. and naturally. And you see that person, he could be in the same position as you. Let, let's say we are team, 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 like, let's say we are workmates in, in, let's say, let's say when I was working for the oil and gas company. No, I know what you're saying. Yeah. That would and you be, walk I in have... the room and you see all, everybody gathered around one person. Because everyone needs to be around him. Everyone wants to get that energy for him, wants to ask him something, wants to know some 100%. information from him. It's like that. That was me in Tyneshire, bro. I'm the youngest guy there. Everyone's been there 10, 15, 20. I, my best friend in Tyneshire, he's been in the same building for 30 years, selling the same thing. And guess what? They, um, every time I go in the office, the directors, the big managers, even the owner, of the entire resort, whenever I walk in there, bro, they all come and say hello. I don't go to no one and say hello. They come to me and say hello. They're all my bosses. They're all my superiors. Like right now, I'm at home, and they call me from uh, Garza Blanca, which is right here across the street. They're calling me like, hey, is there anything that you need? How can I help you? Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, I'm fine, man. He's checking up on me. I should be checking up on him because he's my boss, and he's the director like, this is, these are big-time dudes, man. They make over 20000 a month, and they have, like, a million dollars in bed. They've been doing this for decades. And they're calling me, checking up on me. When I walk in the office, they go to me and shake my hand. They want to sit at my table. I get to leave early, show up, uh, show up late. I have no rules. For the last two years, I've literally been able to do whatever the fuck I wanted. And it's all because of the alpha energy. It's not full what I would want it to be. But it's just like what Danny said. I understand. I learned this in prison, by the way, you guys. When you're, yeah. when you, when you have to learn how to walk around people that are two, three times your size, two, three times more violent than you, two, three times more connected than you, two, three times stronger than you, you kind of get really, really good at handling yourself, right? And 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 that's it. That's when you realize that you don't have to be the biggest guy. You don't have to be the strongest, the smartest, but you better be an alpha. Because if you don't yeah. have, if you're not, I'll put it to you like this. You could be the strongest, smartest, quickest, fastest man in the whole world. And if I walk into that room, you're going to pay attention to me and not the other way around. Like that. Sure. That's, that's the big difference between an alpha and just a regular man. That's right. Think about that. You could be fucking, you could, you could be the strongest guy here, blah, 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 blah. But if you're, if, if, if you're basing your strength on your success or your smarts or whatever it is and not on your alpha energy, I could take it away from you. Alpha energy, no one could take it from you. That's something God gave you. Let's say you get, you get really high because you have all the women. You're like, man, I get all the bitches. Like, really, bro? Yeah, I get them all. I get this one. Like, oh, did you know this one? Oh, I was with her. Yeah, I fucked her last night. Nah, you didn't get hurt. I crushed this whole world. Even though he gets all the, because he, you can get what I'm saying? He gets his pride from that. I know, I know his weak button. Boom, women. If he gets his pride out of the strength, oh, I do this, I bench that. Really, bro? 
like my boy, he's in California. He benches blah, 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 blah. And he's only been doing it five years. I just broke, crushed him. Yeah. But you can't crush an alpha male. They, for one, they won't let you. And two, you won't dare. You just, they, like, like, you see how I talk and my tone and how fast and how much I talk? People don't want to get in an argument with that guy. He fucking talks too much. People would rather, like, fuck that. Exactly. You see what I, so it's like, it's in, 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 long story, long story short, you want to be, you can, you don't want to be a great man. You want to be an alpha male. An alpha male is, it goes beyond the physical body. It's, it's energy. It's all the planets and universes came together to give you that energy. That's right. It's energy, man. It's true. He's like, that's right. That's why they, that's why the firstborn and the boy, let it be a masculine child. Let it be a boy. See, they don't <laughs> yeah. tell us all of this anymore. They don't tell us all of this anymore. But all of that is true, bro. Being a male is the biggest blessing you can get in this whole fucking world. Like, there's nothing else. Like, if you're a woman, guess what? You were born to serve. That's it. <laughs> yeah. You serve your husband. You serve your kids. You serve the neighbors. You serve wherever the fuck somebody t- That's what you do. You're a secretary. You're an assistant. That's what you do. You were born for that. A man, he runs shit. You weren't born to just be running paperwork. All of it, everyone that's like a, pen, a, a pencil pusher and paperwork guy and people that don't run shit and they're men, dude, it is almost impossible for them to bring out their alpha energy. You always are going to see them with their head down or their shoulders slanted or they're always, and because you're playing a role that doesn't belong to you. That's it. When, 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 when men try to play like a woman's role, you don't, you're not going to look good. You won't feel good. You won't do good. That's right. Right? So anyway, so that's, so I guess that's a little bit on the, how did we get into the alpha talk anyway? Oh, because I don't of the, know. the Lamborghini thing. The Lamborghini. The Lamborghini. Yeah. Man, everything Lamborghini. is related to the Lamborghini. <laughs> the, the, the fucking Lamborghini, yeah. So long story short, you want to be the person, we want to be the people with the most value and the al- oh, alpha authority. That's what I'm going to call my next group, the Alpha Authority. That's a good one, Alpha Authority. Like, that's, and it would be a leadership group. Yeah. The alpha Authority yeah. Leadership. And that's where we talk about leadership. Yeah, because we want people to know us for the, the authority we have in the online space, and we're going to have the authority. Why? Yeah. Do you, you know why, right? Because we have the best skills, the best thing. We are. Because we're doing things different. We are doing There different. you go. There you go. That's my boy. Yeah. Idris said it right. Because we're going to be the first ones to do it different. Yeah. And we're going to do it in a way where they benefit a thousand times more than anyone else. Exactly. And, yeah, and we, are, we are the best. You know, well, you know another reason why we're the best, uh, Danny? Because we're the team. only... It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if we have a little bit of skills. The, it, we're better off showing the two or three skill sets that we have than be people with a hundred skill sets and they don't show any of them. Exactly. Since we're gonna show, since we're gonna show everything that we know, we are already automatically the best. I don't know anyone else that has this idea. So let's. I'm me gonna too, write I, all this. I, I, me too. I don't know huh? any, anybody. I don't know anybody who because see if they don't know what you can do, how would how would they know that how cool you are or like if you are. You know, listen, guys. I see that we are going to become and famous who, in the for world. someone who doesn't know even any any kind of these kind of skills. Like, like I I have taught one of my downline in Twenty X Pro how to do speed recruiting. Of course, I don't share the script or something, but I told her verbally how the things goes. Like, like talk to their pain, connect them to the dream take them out and she came up with her own script and things how to tell to people man she was like fucking happy she was recruiting like every time she has a lot of clients now <laughs> i'm happy to hear that bro that's and that's she, a great story. she she think like i am a genius and she's telling me sir danny i love you so much and <laughs> really help me <laughs> This is Ruby, right? But you, you feel like a genius when you're doing this. You don't think I feel like a genius whenever we're doing a Zoom call? I'm like, bro, this is badass. Like, I'm, I'm on a Zoom call. Oh, yeah, yeah, you don't yeah. think I feel like a genius whenever I get somebody to answer to my videos? Like, this, this is an, a, 
an ongoing high for for it is for me. I love making money, and I love I, I just love the whole business aspect of it. So, you is it me or or do you guys still get like a little high off of closing people and getting sales and stuff? Mm, you know something that makes me like feel so happy also because I know that uh, I want to build a famous Instagram profile for. Like I want to have minimum one hundred thousand followers. I mean, I want to pass my father. That's not famous. I thought you were gonna say one million. Get to the M's, bro. Yeah. I've I've been I've been following million millionaire Instagram followers because to me, those are gonna be the people that squash everyone else three years from now. Okay. So I hope right. you guys are taking notes. Those people with millionaire million two million followers, if they if, dude. Man, one one three, post, one post. How much? How much sales they can make? Ah. One post. That's the whole point. Yeah, because Idris, you can do a hundred k, bro. That I, I have friends. Look, fucking Danny, Danny did thirty five percent of that. Yeah, that's yeah. true. That's <laughs> you true. Say, I'm like, I, I was listen. Say, I have a lot listen. Of with let's go for. Bro. Let's go for everything. I mean, listen. I want to be the fucking famous Instagram page. I mean, I want to be the fucking I don't want to be famous because I do acting like my father. No, I want to be famous because they will say, yo, this kid, he's fucking crushing it. He's a marketer, bro. Well, this is what we're going to do then, Idris. Your job, and I don't know what, what, what Danny agrees with this. Why don't, because I need it as well, but I'm not good at it. And, I, and I'm not good at it because I don't care for it. And I don't care for yeah. it because I'm not going to be my new one. That's funny. <laughs> the, Look up how to become. Look up all the hacks that you need on Instagram and how yeah. you can oh. go. That's my territory now. That's what I'm saying. But no, I want you to get fucking crazy. You know how I know you're not the best at it. What do you mean? Because you don't have I, it. Exactly, motherfucker. So you could be your territory all you want. You need to have that following. So yeah, okay. me and Danny can copy what you're doing, and everyone else can copy what you're doing. But you have to lead the way. This is why what we're doing is gonna work. Because we're going to lead the way live. Now, you need to lead the way with your Instagram account. And I think, why don't we stick to that period? Like, Dan Danny will be the guy that talks about finances and stuff like that. I'm sure he's a lot better at it than me. I talk about the mindset. And you become, like, the fucking monster in, in social media hacks. How do you grow an uh, Instagram account? How do you grow a Facebook account? How do you grow yeah. this? Be, because you because that's completely different than a mindset you can know dude my my ex-girlfriend she's got i don't know how many thousands and thousands of fucking followers and she gets like a thousand hearts on all her pictures because she's posting shit on thongs and her titties are all out she gets thousands of views bro she makes zero dollars online no. <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> she's fucking retarded like just and, and i don't mean that in a bad way i just mean like she has no idea yeah, yeah, i mean i mean, I mean. There's a world going on uh so my point is they can know everything about instagram hacks and they still need the mindset and you can know everything about the right mindset the right this but if you don't have the financial structure you you need those three things it just there's no other way around it yeah. let's say you have the right mindset and you know what you nah you're not if you have yeah. the right so you have the mindset you know the the whole strategies and and the financial freedom and everything and you know the skills and tools which is like it is so the whole thing in one place. So imagine and what you can like do with all this. Clear things. weapon. And that's why we're gonna teach how we're using it and we're doing this. Like we're recording this right now. So like I hope that if 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 I don't know who's a good video editor, but you can pick out all these things, put dates on them, because we want to be able to show this to people six months from now. Like, look, dude, yeah. this is how we got to this many millions of followers. Exactly. Like you guys are really having two, three hour long Zooms. That's what it takes. I'm, I'm recording everything. Like from today, I'm recording everything. Like today itself, we have the live. Yeah. And now we have, this is the second recording, by the way. This is the second oh, recording. Oh, good. And we should log it. We're going to log everything because you guys, I want you to get in your head that this is a hundred million dollar page. Yeah. I'm, I'm not fucking kidding. This is a hundred million dollar page. So and I have, I have one more thing that? we can do added to this. We can work on our YouTube channel and we upload everything. Because I went to Darren Little, Darren Little uh, YouTube channel. You know what is his YouTube channel? It is all the it's life he's, all the life he's yeah. doing for for the people. 
That's yeah, it. that's how you do it. That's it. He doesn't do nothing different, bro. That he's been doing that for five years now. Exactly. So all these videos, all this recording, we'll upload them on a YouTube channel. All right. We will all, we'll create a new one. We we'll, let's say we we'll call it the Three Marketeers and so. So we'll be branded everywhere, like Instagram. Let's say Snapchat, YouTube. Let's say Facebook and everything. Because you know what? And anyway, anyway, guys. Anyway, these videos itself. Okay, when we are going to base it on, on a funnel, we have to upload it first on YouTube because that's how funnel work. You have to upload it in YouTube first before you can right. take something into funnels. So these videos, maybe Idris, we can use it for our funnels also. Next webinar, next thing, next stuff. I mean, who knows like where, where we gonna need all this information, you know? That's my point, we don't know when, but we want to be prepared. Yes, exactly. So Idris, tomorrow Idris. when you wake up, let's mm -hmm. let's do let's build a nice YouTube channel, all right? And we upload all of these things, so no. also it will stay forever. We don't lose this uh, data, you know. Let's no, say no. my my computer crash, for example, because this uh, everything is saved now in my computer, and my computer is like like is is piece of shit. It's just. Dell computer, you know, it can go lost or something. But we upload everything on YouTube, and it will stay there forever, you know. And so you listen, can also get a when I go hard drive for like fifty dollars or something. When I go, yeah, you, yeah, buy external, get, you can let's buy let's a terabyte of memory. Yeah, you can buy a a bunch of fucking memory for under fifty bucks. Memory used to be expensive when I was growing up. Now you can get shit for like two dollars USB drive. Very very cheap. It's very cheap. Dude, it used to be fucking like one USB drive, one gig, a hundred dollars. Honestly, you don't need it nowadays because you have Google Drive, for example. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. even there. that. Right. Yeah. I was just saying in case the internet went out or whatever, but I guess <laughs> yeah, because if you have it in a hard drive, yeah. But, you have right, Google so Drive, you can upload it on YouTube, and it will stay there forever. You upload it on Facebook, it will stay forever. It's like that. Dude, I, I, I am thinking, yeah, that's what we're going to do. I don't think we can overdo this content, bro. I don't think so. I think the more, I don't think we could saturate people with this. I think this is why I'm, I'm excited. Like, if we went live 10 times, and it was all about work, yeah. I still don't think that's enough. I don't think you could saturate the page. I think that's, I think the more we do and the more we give, the better the page looks because yeah. we're no longer talking to them. We're talking amongst us. Like right now it's been recording for an hour. This could have been on the page and everyone would have loved it. You guys, this is two because hours of recording. This is two hours already. And who would not love what, you know how many people have two hours to watch this right now? You cannot say not a lot because I watch bullshit at least two hours a day on Facebook. Exactly. I'm going but you know to what we work. have to do, bro? Honestly, if we want to catch the attention of more people, we have to merge yeah. small clips of all our videos. But bro, we, we need variety also on our content. So not only video, 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 but we No, we that's what I'm post. saying. But if we did, right. But yeah. if, look, if, if we did the post, we did the post, we did like two lives a day, we did like four to five posts a day, two lives a day. We do two webinars, seminars a week. The point is to just always be in their face. It doesn't even have to be 10 minute videos. We can do five minute lives and we can yeah. do quick posts. Just send everything through this group. That way we all agree on it or we, we fix any misspellings. Because Idris, you, you have a couple spelling errors on the page. And it's not spelling. It's like you missed the capital letter here. You missed the no. capital letter there. It's shit like that. No Normally, I'm, I'm very careful when I do this thing. All right. Well, never mind then. Uh, but yeah. what was I... Uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> anyway, we'll look at these that? things later on and we'll fix whatever is there missing. But we have to keep variety. Always make sure we have variety in our post and we keep people engaged, you know, with the page. Yeah. And guys, uh, please also send invite to all your uh, Facebook friends so we'll have a lot of engagement yeah, also yeah, yeah, yeah. people will be sharing to other places you know who knows that's how you get let audience me, anyway let me see where is this yeah we'll do yeah we'll definitely do that uh 10 pages mm, marketer where did it go 
invite mentioned friend. there invite it's mentioned there in the home page it's invite no but yeah, yeah i didn't really want to bring anyone from my page but i'll do it i guess i wanted to start brand new with this i was actually thinking about deleting all of my friends i'm like these guys are fucking trash <laughs> i was i'm serious i was like i'm just gonna get rid of this fucking five thousand people because they're they're trash uh, guys, one thing I want to tell you on the group I keep deleting the... every day, almost over 100. Every day I delete. Every day. Because, bro, when people see you, they don't do it after a month or two. Yeah, that's it. They're not going to do it. And for me, I've had the same list for two years, bro. Think about that. Oh, no, no. You have to. You have to. Refresh. You know, the last time. So, look, I'm glad I, we talked this on. What if that's the only thing that's been preventing me from making the money, bro? Exactly. <laughs> Man. Because I, think I... about it. Because it's like. I've had, I have not added a person or deleted a person in two years. Bro, I remove people every single day. Every single day. Over 100 every day. And I keep get fresh feed every time. And that's why we are not making money also. I haven't deleted one in two years, bro. No, no, no. You should, you should start doing that, bro. You should start. Well, that's because I stopped working online, you see? Yeah. And this is what I was talking to. Uh, this is why I was telling... Uh, uh, Sam, that having these mastermind groups, I'm happy that I had the idea and we did the masterminds, but you would not believe how much you guys helped me because you guys are in the action and I've been gone for so long. The last time I jumped online, like I said, it was a year and a half ago. The last time I made a thousand dollar commission, but I only jumped on for like one month. I made a thousand or two and then I got out and then I never came back again. So I came in for one month, made a thousand, two thousand, like my first week or two back and then I got out. And that also might be karma because it's like, dude, you brought two people in and then you just fucking booked. Because I didn't, I didn't stay for all night. I, dude, I was making fucking I, thirty thousand a month is not a lot, but it's a lot. It's like in Mexico, dude. <laughs> Anyways, I I just left. I I took the easy route. I was like, eh, thirty thousand now or a million ten years from now. I'm like, ah, fuck it. I'll take my 30000 now. <laughs> <laughs> because you it's didn't true, love, a company you didn't love the process. You didn't love the journey. You I, know you will true. get there. You believe the, in the process, but you didn't love it. Like, I want the 30000 right now, the, not the million, which is after one year. I'm okay with that because I just got out of prison. So it's like, if, if I already, like, I've been locked down for four years. And now you're giving me thirty thousand dollars a month, bro. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's a lot. <laughs> I went broke fast. I went broke fast, quick. I fucking left my online business. I just went. I just told you I was living, and I had girls everywhere. They, they and this goes back to being the alpha male because I was so focused on fucking bitches, making money, partying, like no one could tell me no. I just told you how I walked in the office. Dude, the directors and the owners, like, how are you doing? Hey, what's going on? Can I, dude, security guard, I had security. I had my own staff at home and outside of the residence, there was security. They would bring me my groceries for me. Dude, all of this happened because in my head, I was either going to live the life of my dreams or die trying. Remember, I used to, I got put away for four years, bro. And I get out, and then you deport me from the States to Mexico. And I'm thinking my whole world is over. But then you pay me more in Mexico than you would than I've ever been paid in the United States. Dude, here in Mexico, the doll, every dollar is times 20. I'm a multimillionaire in Mexico. And, like, I've never been a multimillionaire. So imagine uh -huh. that, going from nothing, right, to, to fucking four years in prison to a multimillionaire. Yeah, that's what happened to me. That's my life story. So far, I'm only 29. So it's like, it's, it's, so of course I was going to fucking live that out. Hell yeah. <laughs> I took my money. I left the online world. And I just, I started doing all kinds of drugs and parties. And I was just wild. And Be, because I mean, it's, I was it's, doing that. It's, it's the hell, hell of time because, you see, you need a lot of tools and, and strategies to get to the million dollar. But once you figure out all the tools together, all the things you need to have, to get you there it is fast bro it will it will take us maybe two weeks when we will make a, a million dollar but it, maybe we will need maybe six months to figure out how to make a million dollar it's like no, we already know how we're gonna make a million i already did the numbers last night yeah yeah, yeah. i already i already did the numbers on the 20 dollar one just on giving the, the example one. you know yeah 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we no. Your example is correct, but before we met, your example is a hundred percent correct. But now I don't feel like there. I'll tell you this, you guys. I've, I, my experience, not only in business, not only closing millions of dollars in sales, not only working online and, and, and building a massive team online, because I did, I did really good when I was in backups. I was a leader from my very first year. And from all my experience, I'm going to tell you this. If there's more that we need outside of what we currently have in the three marketeers, then, then I mean – there i'll put it to you like this there ain't because there's been people out there that has made 10 times more money than us with less than what we have in the three marketeers that's right so like that's what i'm saying like there's nothing else for us to learn it's just about putting it into action yeah yeah execute yeah i don't feel like there's another person i need to go find anymore it's like i have you guys i don't feel like there's another product i need to go find i have thousand dollar commissions twenty dollar commissions we get 2,000, we get 2 million, that's it, finish. What do you mean finish? That's the start. Yes, but, no, but the I goal, mean but we're to the first goal, goal bitch. Yeah. Okay. To the first goal. <laughs> yeah. And because that's what it is. Look, 2,000 times 1,000, that's 2 million. That's, that's, you see? It's yeah. simple. But, but, but we had to figure out how we're going to bring people. Now we know. Do what we're doing right now, constantly, day in and day out. And so we have that breakthrough where people are like, dude, have you been following the three marketeers? No, what do they do? They're building. They should even know what we're building and they should see us build it in the process and then blow it up anyways. We should be the guys that disrupt the online world. Because okay. let's say we don't make the millions of dollars with this. We'll be famous to the point that they will give us the millions of dollars anyways. It's what happened on Facebook. The guy from Napster or Rhapsody, what's his name? From, they remember he bought, he got the money for the Facebook guy. Have you guys seen the social experiment, the Facebook movie? The social network. The social yeah, network. Have you seen the movie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you seen Justin Timberlake, how he played the role of the guy from yeah. Napster? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That guy was broke and he got fired and blackballed from everywhere. Why? Because he disrupted the music industry. But then he went ahead and got hired by Mark Zuckerberg and retired a billionaire with a B. Yeah, 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 yeah. So his goal was to make $10 million with music, and he built it, and then they sued him. They took the $10 million, but because of his experience, he made out with over a billion <laughs> with a B. <laughs> you're laughing because that's a beautiful ass story. That's you're beautiful, not, you're not, bro. You're not laughing because it's funny. You're laughing because that is such a magical and beautiful story to hear. For, if you're an entrepreneur, if you're an honest business person, you can appreciate that story. You're like, that's just, that's what's up. The nah, guy nah, was nah. going for 10 million, but he went overboard. It goes back to, remember what I said? You can never go overboard when you're after something. This guy went overboard. He didn't just bring you all the music. He brought it to you for free. And he didn't just bring it to you all and all for free. He brought it to your cell phone. And not just to your cell phone, he allowed you to download it. And not only that, he gave you a license for it. So it's legal. So he eliminated, <laughs> remember when people used to burn CDs? Eliminated yeah. that shit. People used to steal music and torrents and rip them, eliminated that. Remember they used to charge people for music? He eliminated that. He eliminated everything single-handedly. <laughs> and all he wanted was $10 million, and he made it out with a billion. And he started with fucking music, and he ended up becoming a, a co-owner of Facebook. Isn't that crazy? That's but it's amazing. because of... But it's because of he had the mentality that I'm telling you right now. It's we need to disturb the industry. We're not really going for it to influence people here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Because we're not gonna talk to them. We're gonna talk amongst us. What's our in the morning? We're gonna say what's our project? What are we gonna do here? What are we doing there? Cool, cool. Let's write that down. And how many days do we have? Three, four days. Our audience now knows this needs to be done in the next three or four days. Three, four days come. They're gonna pick their head up. Let's see if they did it. Is the funnel done? Yes. Wow, these guys are fucking great. Guess who they're gonna want to join? The guys that said in three, four days we're gonna have a funnel done, and in three, four days when they checked, the funnel was done, and they got to see us do it. That's right. So now they know they can do it. They saw us doing it. So it's gonna be one or two things. Either we're gonna make a bunch of fucking millionaires, and they're gonna call us to give us money, or we're gonna blow up. Either way, we're winning with this. My point is that I don't see us losing by by doing this. I just don't see how it can go wrong. I uh, already like that. There is like one one 
and this is how when people follow you now uh, because these people they are signing up with us right now they want to learn the email marketing they have to use our affiliate link they want to learn the mm -hmm. click funnel they have to use our affiliate link so imagine if we grow our our audience to buy our other services which is already there actually but through us because we are going to teach them on on like one to one all right so the three marketeers this is going to be the the marketing agency man yeah we're going to do it all it is the marketing agency 100 percent. yeah because we're going to do it all because I, I i'm I, I forgot what you what you were talking about email funnel training speed recruiting training all these things you can charge whatever you want to teach them so you can always keep upselling people within the group definitely Man, and awesome. and let's say all those people that that do make it and let's say they go bigger than us because there's going to be more ideas and opportunities out there this is why i'm telling you guys we need to write this opportunity out immediately starting tomorrow morning when you guys wake up because if not somebody else is going to do it i learned it in uh the art of attracting money or something like that. And he was talking about whenever you get an idea, I want you to know that the, that the universe, yeah. oh, it's Idris. I want you to hear this out, bro. Yeah. yeah. It's so true. He says that whenever you get an idea, write it, it down. Huh? Write it down. Not just that the, the everyone else around you got the same idea. Do you yeah. know that uh, ideas is nothing more than energy? Yeah. Okay. So, so if I got this idea, or you got this idea, that means there was a ball of energy, let's say that was dropped right here. And everyone in this vicinity got the same idea. Transfer. But the only one that collects it is the one that acts on it. And what he was talking about on the secrets of attracting money is that when you understand this, you always start working. If you're one of those people, oh, well, let me see if they already made up that name. Well, let me see if the product's already out you won't make it. And you know why the ether, the universe gives the same idea to hundreds of people? Why? Because the universe knows that 99.9% .9 of the people that get the idea are not going to take action. They will not do anything, right? <laughs> so imagine if the universe gave it to one person and that one person doesn't want to do it. Now the universe can't carry out its dreams. So the universe, AKA will say God or Allah or whatever you want to look at it, gives it to everyone around that area. Because he's hoping that one person, remember, we have free will. God loves you, but you are a God as well. Therefore, you have free will. Even if God sends you the idea, you're allowed to say, no, I'm not doing it. Sure, you could be punished, but you still said no. Long story short, uh, this, the, the audio book was talking about yesterday that have you ever thought of something and then like two days later you walk in the store and you see it there? Or you talked about it with someone and then somebody will call you and tell you, hey, I was thinking about this. No fucking way. I was thinking about the same thing. And when, he, and when he brought this to my attention, he said, if you notice, every time you had a good idea, somebody else had the same one. Exactly. Think about it. And uh, he it said, happened to me already. And this is something like a few years back. And I had an idea that I want to create an app. All right. And I will have a mobile truck. All right which uh, carry on any, if your car, let's say, break down, all right? So you request the service, all right, from a, a team who will come and fix your car on the road. You don't have to take it to car, uh, let's say, garage or yeah, something. Road, yeah, road and services. what happened, <laughs> someone has implemented the same thing exactly 100%. Yeah. It means, it means it was not only my idea, it went to, through many people, but I didn't act on it. Someone has done it. None of, none of these ideas are ours. That's why it's okay. This is why we're going to be rich, you guys, because I have the knowledge and you have the knowledge. So look, the reason I am okay with sharing everything that we know online for free, because I understand that we don't own these ideas. I got um we don't own the, these are not my ideas they're not your ideas guess what when you die that idea stays here and somebody else would do it so then you know it was never yours anyways god just drops the energy and he's like let's see who's going to take advantage of it 
It's almost like a video game. And he's dropping a little box with food and tools and let's see who's going to use it. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? It's just out of nowhere. Yeah. Boop, I'm going to drop the internet. Let's see who does something with it. Boop, I'm going to drop airplanes. Let's see who can make something with it. Boop, I'm going to drop whatever. That's how the universe works. And you need to be so in tune with your godly self that you understand this. So you're like, oh, I got something new in the game. Because this is like the Matrix. Remember we talked about it. It's like a video game. Oh, wow. Now we have this. For yeah. us, is what we came in that we realized that it's, it's what's selling now is being genuine, being kind, and giving that honest value up front without asking for anything. So, yeah. like, that's what, we, that's what we can work with right now. But I forgot. I was going to say something based on what you said. Oh, yeah. It's none of our ideas, bro. This is why you have to take action on it. It's almost like if you don't put your name on the orange juice, it belongs to the house. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you that's don't right. put your name on the orange juice, it belongs to the house, baby. Yeah, so if you put right. your name on whatever idea came to you, it belongs to the house. Let anybody drink from it. You didn't that's put right. your name on it. It ain't yours. <laughs> you see what I mean? So this is why this is the this is why the whole idea thing, it's like, uh, I listened to it yesterday and it worked again this morning. I was thinking about my ex and I told you guys that she called and, yeah. and everything I told her I was thinking about, she was thinking about the same thing. And that's what she started crying and blah, blah, blah. Long story short, it, what that book was saying is true. Whenever somebody gets an idea, rest assured that there's a hundred other people that got the same idea at the same time. First one to take action gets to keep the idea. We already took action. We already went live, so it's okay. Yeah. But that's, that's how right. it is for everything. That's how it is for everything, you guys. Everything. And like you said, the app, it's happened to you. It's happened to me. It's oh. happened to it's 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 happened to everybody. Yeah. But so then what 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 do you guys think? Anything else before we uh Yeah, before we go, I want to tell you guys uh in the group, please be careful when accepting people. Be sure they are part of 20x pro uh this is a very powerful tool for recruiting already there is a guy there who requested to join he said he's not part i sent him a message so let's try to get this guy on board now so this is how it works this is what the group is for to contact people so the the group just we have to be careful that we don't get anyone there because initially there is some few people i told him to kick them out if they are not where is the group what group i'm not in this group you are. You are there. You are there. Also. A Facebook group? Yeah. yeah. The yeah. three marketeers, when you click uh, sign up button on the page, will, it, it will take you, you to the group. Yeah. To the page. There is seven members already. Who oh. are in 20X Pro. Yeah. That's where you did the vi That's where you did the live, bro. The live was on the page normally. What? Oh, uh, George. The, yeah. the live video on the group, it was supposed to be on the page, but it's okay because now at least we have some things, you know, on the group. The live video of, of George, it's in the group? Yes, and the main live video is on the page. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So it's okay, guys. Done. All right. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you. Have a good night, both of you. Talk to you tomorrow. All right, all right. So every, sorry, I was responding to this guy. So everything's good then? We'll just finish yeah, this man. up tomorrow? All good. All right. All right. Later. All right. Later, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take some rest. All right. All right. Save the recording. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it automatically will be yeah. saved. It's automatically. All right. Very good.